Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Let me tell you sir, sir, we respect you. I respect you a lot. It was the youths that put you in power. And believe me, if you can make any single mistake, bringing back these criminals from PF and putting them in UPND, sir, you, we are going to remove you from that seat. I'm telling you the gospel truth. You may not even finish your term. What I'm telling you, sir, is that people of Zambia voted for you so that you can get rid of corruption. Sir, please get rid of corruption and get rid of it completely. All those that are supposed to go to jail must go to jail. All those that stole must go to jail. That is the only way you are going to rule Zambia peacefully, nicely. Don't accept those criminals that we are in PF. All of them want to come to UPN now to come and destroy. They, they we are calling you a Satanist. They we are calling you Satan. Including kings. Kings was calling you a Satan. Sunday Sinyang was calling you a Satan. Ian was calling you a Satan. Most of these Pentecostal hungry men and women of God in Zambia, they were all calling you a Satan. Now they want to come and start eating with you. Once you accept them to the party, you destroy your party. Be very careful. We supported you from the bottom of our heart. We tried everything possible. Even the time that we are in fight fighting us, calling us criminals, calling us comment, calling us a lot of things. Be very careful, sir. Please be very, very careful. Embrace the people that love you so much. All those people, you've seen those musicians, they are coming back to you now. They are your brothers, they are your sisters, but treat them like Judas. Jesus Christ had no problem with Judas. He treated Judas well, he showed him love, but he knew that he was a betrayer. And he, he took him like a betrayer. Don't hate anybody, but allow the law to work. And uh, don't trust these people that are coming back now. All the people that ever posted the things of PF on their page in the name of a, 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 a bait for advert, political bait for advert, all of them are criminals. You have seen the way they've turned against Eddie Galungu today. It's the same way they will turn against you tomorrow. In fact, if you did not win this election, they were planning to laugh at you. Be very careful. Your friends are few. Your enemies are many. Now that you are a president, everybody wants to come and embrace you. The same way they embraced Eddie Galungu and destroyed him. Be very careful. All those people that we are doing a, a, a political bait for political adv advert, they hate you. They don't love you. You may not have opportunity to watch me today, but I'm saying, sir, don't take the root of Eddie Galungu. Avoid all those criminal men of God that was doing Christian for Lungu. Those are criminals. Avoid all those people that we are doing political paid advert. Those are criminals. They are, they are green snake in green grass. Avoid them. I don't say hate them. I don't say turn against them. No. Your duty is to unite Zambia, but don't bring them close to you. Show them love from far. Show them love from far. Don't bring them close to you. Defectors, they have started defecting. They are starting to come to you. They are starting to come to you. They are starting to come to you now. Don't accept them in your party. 
grow your party with these people that you can trust these people that we are with you from the beginning appreciate all the people that we are fighting genuinely fighting for you don't be like Eddie Galungu if you behave like Eddie Galungu you will only rule one thing abolish Kada don't allow Kada to take market don't allow them to take bus station let because you are wise let wisdom rule in Zambia at least for the first time let Zambian people breathe for the first time after six good years let Zambian people breathe they were dying they were crying they were looking for Messiah that is why they have voted for you there is a uh, Sikaili Mr. Sikaili there is a uh, uh, the other one Moto, Moto Ntola, I've forgotten his name is also the one that they arrested all of you did very good job proud Mushimba proud Mushimba you did marvelously well so many of you how many of you am I going to mention all those people that we are calling you were calling them anywhere you go you want to go with them now you have been appointed you why are you what what are you changing your number for because your president a whole president of zambia up to today he has not changed his number the same number is using on whatsapp the same number is using is the same number is, is still using a president didn't change his number then an idiot like you that was appointed a minister or appointed in this small small position you change your number for what reason Eh? You think that you can use people in this government and go scot free? It can happen. Get your number and start calling those people you are calling when you are campaigning. Don't be stupid. You don't learn something from 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 PF. All those people that you promise job, make sure that you are getting them jobs. All the people that got job as PF cadres must lose their job, and UPND members, Zambian people must go and occupy those positions. Start working it out now before we start fighting you. There are youths that sacrificed for UPND to be where it is. What have you done for them? Have you even called them on the phone as a youth minister and thank them for the sacrifice they did? Eh? I saw many of you calling uh, Matomela, Ma Matomela or something. You are calling him a uh, 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 what? You are calling him a uh, a uh, uh, saboteur because he was begging money from a lady from UK and he was sent to one thousand a man that fought like that that went to sell several times tried to make you get into power through social media you got into power and they cannot even afford food it's begging for one thousand and you you are laughing everything is okay for you right every night you dress you comb your hair every every day you dress Eh? you comb your, your hair you paint your body you paint your nails climb into a, a vx eh? in aircon go to gym after gyming yeah you take a picture you post it on facebook for the people that suffered for the country to clap for you right to clap for you to say hey our minister you have you have six pack you are an idiot Hey, our 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 peers, you are you are you are looking handsome. For who? For what? Are people going to eat handsome? Are people going to eat gym? These people, that uh, honorable Matomela, and so many of them. How about uh, Larry Mwetwa? In 2016, he was he was nearly killed by the PF. How many times was he harassed? Many many youths lost hope in UPND. Harimwetwa was giving hope. When we were busy working for Edgar Galungu, Harimwetwa was a threat to us because he was giving information on Facebook. Where is he today? Is he not a youth? Has he been remembered? Is he not the work of the youth minister to look out for these people?
the president cannot do all this thing alone the president has the responsibility to market zambia eh? 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 how about uh, how many of them am i going to mention how about mubita now i know that mubita now there, there is something on the pipeline for him but it's one year others are receiving salary when you start paying him salary now are you going to pay him the, the one year that he that he, he, he has not been employed eh? how many of them am i going to mention pf cadres especially those that fought for the government have become poorer than they were when they came when they were in opposition <laughs> at least when they were in opposition they were at least even eating now they have even become poorer <laughs>